So my first question for you is how do you think your presentation went? I think my presentation went pretty well. I, I was, as a, like a public speaker, I tried to do well, like making eye contact with the audience and trying to speak clearly. I think I went a little too fast at parts, but that was my own, own thing. But I think I did pretty well overall. Awesome. Well, I kind of have a little bit more insight in your project than mm -hmm. some of the other projects because yours did involve our entire grade level. Yeah. Um, so I was hoping you'd want to talk a little bit about what it was like to do your red and blue card experiment. Well, it was really interesting doing the red and blue card because it was like, <laughs> I've seen it be done before, but I've never actually been like part of it. Um, basically, every like student got a card, a red and blue card, and it started with a specific set of students had only red cards. So they were like the, the like, the pioneer <laughs> species of the grade level. So they went out and infected people and it just it went really interesting because you saw like in the first five seconds everybody was almost infected because those people, you, we have so much physical contact in our day to day life, it's so easy to think that person that just lightly touched on the shoulder could have given you a super scary disease. So it went pretty well. As you can see, most of our grade level got infected with it pretty soon. Um, by first period, everybody was infected with it. And I think it went well because we couldn't affect each other in classrooms and we couldn't run. So I think nobody really got hurt trying to like tackle someone, but it just went overall. I'm like, yeah. Awesome. Um, and so from your experience with that, um, I guess, experiment mm -hmm. <laughs> and your PSAs that resulted as, um, as I kind of from what you learned, mm -hmm. uh, what kind of advice do you have to um, future students who are wanting to do a similar project? Um, the advice I would give them is like, so know what you're doing, kind of, no, not, kind of that and this. The most, most advice I would give is, like, have fun doing this, experiment on different things. Like, I didn't really know what my PSA was going to look like, so I just kept experimenting, doing different things, um, going back and forth with um, options, like filming, and doing, experimenting with music, and how does that play a role. So if they're going to do this, I would definitely say, like, experiment with the thing don't have one set of plan that you're only going to follow all the way through have definitely like be open to changing things be open to creating new things and going this way and that way so um yeah. if you were to continue this kind of project where could you see it uh, going if i would continue i could definitely see be, be one of those scary commercials like the like the animal abuse ones with the sad arm yeah, um, I definitely see myself doing something like that, trying to make it even like wider and get more awareness on the subject, or being one of the people that studies superbugs specifically, and studying like how they're evolving. Is there any way we can stop them? What are new types of antibiotics to try to fight them? So I can definitely see myself doing something like that. Awesome. Is that it? Um, well, I guess my last little thing is, what kind of advice would you give to anyone doing a mentorship program like this? Uh, the mentorship program. Just <laughs> relax is what I would say. I was really like scared to be like, oh, do I look okay? Like, is she gonna judge me or is this gonna be, she's gonna be super mean? Just relax, they're a person too. They have a similar interest with you. So don't worry like, oh, what, I can't say the wrong thing. What if she, her favorite color is not blue? Like just kind of relax and be open to like learning with the person. They're not gonna be super smart and like the most amazing thing. They're gonna have, they're gonna have like little failures too and they're gonna learn from this experiment too, so. Awesome, yeah. I appreciate that. All right, I have a certificate mm -hmm. of achievement for you. Oh, you can see, this one's you. <laughs> <laughs> and this is just for your involvement in the program Aww. this year. Thank and you. And I just want to thank you for everything you've learned and gone through Aww, this year. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.